I'm from Albuquerque, New Mexico, born and raised. I commute every day to Santa Fe, where I'm the Director of Facilities Management Division for the state of New Mexico. The Facilities Management Division is responsible for the maintenance and construction of 32 state government buildings. The New Mexico Green Energy Project is the largest renewable energy efficiency project that the state has undertaken. Our facilities are over 50 years old. The deficiency of our facilities are the number one challenge. TRAIN helped with the initiative to do the investment grade audit. We identified savings of $1.1 million a year, which is huge. It not only makes economic sense, but also we're doing something really good for the environment. New Mexico is on the front lines of experiencing climate change. So we know that we need to take strong action. And, and one of those things is to reduce our energy consumption. New Mexicans are also very proud of our natural resources and water is life here. Uh, any strategies that help us be more sustainable, reduce our water use, reduce our impact, um, are things that I think all New Mexicans can support. There's so much to be proud of on this project. Uh, one of the coolest things is that we actually installed the largest single site solar PV renewable generation system on the backside of a meter. So basically what that means is the largest solar PV system that isn't owned by a utility in the state of New Mexico. Because HVAC, most people don't know, is the reason for about 45% of your energy spend within your building. It's the heaviest piece of equipment, right, in terms of energy usage. Today's technologies are much more energy efficient to start with, and going from 30-year-old equipment to brand new equipment reduces that energy usage even more. We're saving over a megawatt of energy, which is equivalent to a thousand homes annual energy usage. Water isn't necessarily energy. Right. But there's an energy water nexus because there's still cost savings with that water. And especially as water becomes more scarce within the Southwest specifically, it's very important that we also tackle water as part of our projects. And so upgrading those to low flow fixtures reduce the amount of water that the state used on a daily basis. We want to be wise stewards of taxpayers' dollars, so a project like this that saves money while saving energy is just a win-win. But I'm also proud of the fact that the building's going to be a healthier place for my staff and the public who visit us. We do call it the land of enchantment. The hues are different, the landscape colors change, and it's just a beautiful place and a magical place. It just makes me want to protect it.